Yo, what's up, everybody? B-Boy Spaz here again. And we're pretty much going to talk about Reason's layout. Um, This is pretty much for anyone starting out with Reason, just kind of looking at it, kind of lost. Um, If you know anything about Reason, you see here I'm only on Reason 3. But most of it's pretty much the same. Um, So if we look here at the top, this is our audio in out and our MIDI in out for actually outboard gear or other programs. Um, one thing about the audio out, this is what you use if you're rewiring with another program and you're patching your sound out to that program, for instance Pro Tools or something. Um, you can pretty much put all your stuff in there and then just mix it through whatever program you're using. Now the rest of this stuff down here is pretty much just how I have it set up. So this part at the top is always going to be there. And under it you can set it up however you would like. The way I ended up setting it up is I put a micro mix. And I connected it directly to the 1-2 of this hardware interface. Remember all your sound has to go through the 1 and 2. So if you're just using Reason that's where you're going to want to connect it. The reason I made the main mix is so that if I end up having multiple mixers, because I've made tracks like that before, I can route each of those mixers into the micro mix and then out to the one too. As you see here too, I just have a little Maelstrom, one of the synths and reason, and I have it connected up to this mixer. When you have a synth, it will actually show up down here. And that's the track that you'll be recording the sounds on. We have our different buttons for changing the view to our piano roll or not. Editing our MIDI and things. The pointer, the pencil, things of that sort. Your quantizing, how it's going to snap to the bar. And actually this, this is for um, moving things to the bar. This is your quantizing in this section how much you want to quantize and at what rate so just remember when it comes to quantizing too that you always want to have it up to the fastest notes you're playing or higher so with 116 basically I'm playing 16th notes or anything lower than that if I was playing 32nd notes I would need to do at least 32 but I could also do 64 When you hit tab, you'll be able to get to the back. And the cool thing about this is this is where you can actually take your cables and move them to where you would like them to be and make all your hookups by just clicking and dragging. And that's actually a quick look at Reason's layout. Don't forget to stay up on my page because I'm going to make a couple of more tutorials. Um, I'm going to be talking more about Reason. A lot of stuff about Reason. Reason is an awesome program. And um, I also recently got the record beta. So I might show a little bit about that and, you know, what kind of stuff it can do um, after I figure it out. <laughs> so thanks for subscribing. Keep up with it. And don't forget to shoot me any questions. All right. Peace.